best is to compete for a research proposal for our anonymous scientists. Contestant two, Drosophila melanogaster. Contestant three, Muse Muselis. Contestant one, please tell us a little bit about yourself. Um, as a model organism, I think I am a good choice uh, because I have two or nearly 200 genes homologous uh, with human genes that are really and around 23 that uh, code for cancer alone. Wow, that's an interesting fact there. And Drosophila melanogaster. I commonly get used as a model organism because I'm small and take up little space. I'm extremely fertile and cheap. My genes result in varying phenotypes that can be easily seen, so I would be a good choice for you. Extremely fertile, I heard that. Contestant three, you speechless. Please tell us what about yourself. I'm the best model organism of choice because I have genetic knockouts that are available. And I was the first mammalian genome sequence in the year 2002. And I'm already well researched and I'm homologous with humans. There you have it. Please stay tuned after this commercial break. Hi, welcome back to One on One with Model Organisms. Now, to reveal our contestants. Please, please turn around. Now, our anonymous scientist, who is via web phone, would like to ask our contestants a few questions. Alright. First question, this is for all contestants, is what is your method of reproduction? And how often do you reproduce? Um, I reproduce asexually, and my doubling time is actually within two hours. Wow, pretty quick, huh? Contestant two, what is your method of reproduction, and how often do you reproduce? I reproduce sexually every 24 hours. Mm. Okay. Now you'd like to ask contestant three the same question. Um, I reproduce sexually and reproduce every four to six days all throughout the year. Okay, and for the next question, our scientists would like to ask, what is your greatest asset and how can you contribute to a genetics experience? Um, a couple of years back, I was used as a model organism to study cell cycle checkpoints by Hartwell and Nurse. Two. What, are, what are your greatest assets and how can you contribute to the field of genetics? I was the first model organism to contribute to genetic mapping. Contestant three. Um, my uh, biggest asset is I am closely related to humans and I can be used to study um, diseases and cancers um, that occur in humans. Okay. I, think, I think our scientists have made a decision, ladies and gentlemen. And for a drum roll, please. And the winning contestant is... Contestant 1!